Yeah. Woo! Record time. Everybody's live. You can intro. Hi, I'm Joel. This is my beautiful wife, <laughs> who had a birthday yesterday. Stephanie Dunn. I'm so young. <laughs> Um, hi guys. I know some of you are new. We don't, I'll just skip my birthday because yeah, but, um, for those I see of everybody you, lip, lipping happy birthday. Yes. For those of you that don't know who we are, or maybe going to be watching the replay, we are Stephanie and Joel Dunn, and we have been with the company for 10 years, achieved the rank of black diamond, which is a hundred thousand a month plus for six consecutive months. And so I love that we share that. I don't always share that, but we started as a distributor, just like what we're going to go back to today. The topic is back to basics. I'm totally okay with being a basic babe. I think that we sometimes forget how simple this business really is. And so I just want to get back to what I did and what really works and what I'm seeing that's working and, and not to get into the comparison game too. And I think that that's an important part. There's lots of notes um, and things that we'll be putting up in the chat. So I think Joel's probably going to, if you guys have stuff, start asking some things on here. But if you can't, he's going to put a, a stop to some of the comments because there's a lot of good info. I've got that you guys 11 want to take. billion notes that I'm going to have yeah. to put in here. So I'm going to have to shut down the chat so that I can actually put them in for you guys to see. I know you guys all love us putting that there, right? So if you do, if you love these, right now you can put, drop your a number one. Um, yes, you love them. And okay. for those of you that aren't aware, we do put all of these on YouTube, on our YouTube channel, which is joelandstephaniedunn.tv. And then we copy and paste and put all of the notes in the section underneath that gives you all of the episode info. So if you ever think that you miss something, Wait for us to post the replay so that you can go in and find all of this stuff in there. Yeah, but this is going to be really a quick training. I hope I can get through it fairly quick so that you guys can reference this back to a brand new distributor. And even if you're like, you know what, today I really want to start and pretend that you're brand new yourself and just walk through the process. I think that sometimes we forget, uh, even as, as us being in 10 years, the websites change, we add new products. So it's always so good to just refresh ourselves and act like we're a brand new distributor. So where do we start? You have some. Yeah, I'm just going to give you the number one tip. Every single month, Stephanie starts over as a brand new distributor. That's her mindset. Every single month. I'm brand new. I need to go out and find new people. And I'm still scared. <laughs> I think it's just who we are. We're human. What are people going to think of us? You know, it's something that um, probably will never go away. It gets easier because I really want you guys to have this mindset of, I wish somebody would have told me maybe a little bit earlier of, um, it doesn't matter. They don't pay your bills. I want you guys to have success and to jump in and you learn along the way. I mean, I, I did do that. So some of this stuff is going to be, um, scary to some, but you have to do it. And I think that's what, what's exciting. So, what we do as a brand new distributor, you're already a distributor, you just joined, congratulations, so now what? You're gonna log in. I think that was something for me, I was a clicker and I was a little bit nervous to click around because I thought, what if I click out of something or whatever? You're not gonna break your website, but it's important for you to know how to send someone to your website. So the first thing you should be doing as a new distributor or if you've enrolled as a distributor is send them their login information and how they do that. Okay, so make sure you do that. Connect app. We need to make sure we download the, the IW Connect app and start logging in there because lots of updates happen throughout the day and week and months through that. And so, if you were unaware, all of the new distributor training is inside of the Connect app. Mm -hmm. So log in and I think, I don't know where I put this in, in the messages, but go through and look at the product. And I think this is probably one of my most favorite tips. And you guys, this goes back, gosh, I, I'm looking at some of my old new notes because it's back to basics. And I love it because I highlighted it as, um, well, newbies, but how to grab your four, four loyals even before you get their kit. Like, I think that's what we want, right? We want to make sure that as a new distributor, as somebody that we're 
we're, we're teaching that how can they get their four customers right away? So Joel's going to put that in there. And um, the one thing that I, I don't know where if, it, if it's right in there, but it's, um, it's asking a favor. And I don't think that we talk about that enough is just asking for favors. And let me see where that's at. Um, yeah, so, so he's gonna put this out. So it's the newbies, how to grab your four loyals, and then it's the favor card. So I want you guys to highlight this, keep this in your note and do favor card, newbie checklist or something for you. But um, what you're gonna do is you're gonna write that down the favor list, but you're gonna log in and you're gonna look at every product. As you're looking at product, you should have a notebook out and you should see product that goes, oh my gosh, so-and-so could use this. Like for me, I know that my family, my mom's sisters are huge coffee drinkers. We have coffee that's great for weight loss, for energy, for feeling full. So my mind would trigger, oh my gosh, I need to call my Aunt Mary and see if she would switch her coffee because I know she drinks it every day, multiple cups a day, to my coffee and support me in my new business. And so that's the favor card. That is something that we should all be doing. Even if you never have, why can't we go back to um, our family right now and pull that out, say, oh my gosh, I've been thinking about you. We just launched this new product and I would love for you to do this. And so I actually put in there what you can, what you can say, what you can text to them about having them do you the favor and giving their honest testimony. Like most of us have aunts, cousins, friends, somebody that you trust enough that would support you. So that's really where I, I think that we should be starting. And that seems so, so simple, right? The favor card. And um, I love that I was going through these notes. I was sitting outside and going over things with Joel and I'm like, gosh, I haven't pulled this one out in so long, but it makes perfect sense even as we're, as we're going through. So if you guys are seeing this, have them on, can they come in again? I want to see if you guys read that, if this makes sense to you guys at all. If, if somebody's read this, um, okay. And I love that. Use it as your sponsor. Like as I'm reading through, through there, my sponsor said it would be amazing for my business to get personal testimonies. You guys want that if you don't have your, your own personal testimony yet, you're going to want to include that. Say, hey, I'm starting, starting my challenge with a keto coffee or whatever product you want, I thought this would be fun to do together. So that's a great thing to get started on. Really, where do you go for a new distributor? You log in, you look at the product, you're starting to think of names and you're writing those names down. And that kind of just flows right into your hundreds list, okay? So that's something that we should be doing every single day anyways, adding to. Now, as a new person, you might be like 100 people. I don't know 100 people. It's okay. Just start adding people that come to mind, okay? Going through your Facebook, go through your phone, but start to do your hundreds list. Uh, the next thing that we should be doing is having a launch party. I think we've got away from that so much more because of social media, which is totally fine. I love social media. I, I love that. But what we're seeing right now is where I'm seeing people boom is the parties and that, that connection that you have and how do we create that? And I think um, that's where the scary comes from a little bit. And that was me though. We didn't have social media, okay? Back in my day. We didn't and it was scary and I was like, but this is how I need to learn. And so I was willing to I did, I did the favor card on my sister-in-law and said, hey, would you be willing to host a party for me? Like have three or four people over and start small guys. If you have a huge party, you're gonna feel overwhelmed. It's okay to start with two, three, four people, but you're gonna get better and better. So I would recommend starting three to five people just because it is a little intimidating, especially if you're like, I don't know all the product yet, it's okay just get it out there but ask the people we're in fall people are more willing to have some parties and i picked up some really cool things that i think are going to help you guys with the pumpkin spice craze i didn't realize 
y'all are crazy for pumpkin, pumpkin spice, like nuts. So just to give you some numbers on pumpkin spice, you guys know that it happens in like a three month time frame. Did you know that the pumpkin spice market for last year equated to $500 million? And that was like, what, just a couple months? That's just in a couple months. Basic girls be crazy <laughs> about the pumpkin spice to the tune of $500 million in 90 days every single year. Who wants to get a piece of that this year? Yep, we are. Yeah, we're about to. So you're going to you're gonna pull out your favor. You're going to pull out, um, and I'm going to give you some scripts to do for creating these parties. And this is something you guys have to have to do you have to ask if you don't ask the it's always going to be no so if you need to pair up with somebody see if somebody's in your team page is local that you guys could do them together but you know challenge yourself to get some parties on the books and why i know what's going to happen you're going to start creating the momentum you're into fall you're going to start adding distributors you're going to kind of create a snowball effect for yourself that's just going to boom into the new year and so I love that. That's why I've always been person to person. And when you get in front of them, they see your passion. They see what you've done. They see that excitement. And so start. We've had so many different products that people don't even know that we have all of the product. Like people were like, whoa, you have all these flavors for coffee. So for me, what I'm doing is I just went actually to um, Marshall's and some of you may have them, but they have these cute little on the go pumpkin spice how cute are these they're by ray dunn and they were like four dollars and i think you get like eight or ten or something so they came like this and so i'm gonna do like um you know anybody that hosts i'm gonna do a little sample bag together for the people that come so that i can get people butts in seats people love free samples so they're gonna try it and they're gonna get to take a few things home so this is a great way to, to jump in on the pumpkin spice craze is just look around. You guys will, you will find so much that you're just like, oh, I want to do that. So that's a great way to start. Get one party in the books. And then the idea is from that party to again, book another party and, and we'll see that. So can you scroll back up through my notes? I don't have it all written down. So yeah. you've got that, you've got your list, you've got, okay, who can I reach out to, to ask for parties? You know, if you're on Instagram, Another great thing to do for locals, for, for your area, for your city, is see who's tagged certain cities around you and just reach out and say, hey, I think I think I noticed that you're local. I'm doing some giveaways. Would be, you be willing to host a party? And so I did that. Um, this is one of one that I'm actually going to send out. Would you be willing to host? Well, this is, um, hey, Susie, I'm super excited to ask this question. So this is what I'm sending right now. I've actually been challenged, so don't feel pressured, but this would be fun. I put that out there because I don't want people to feel pressured. And once I take that off for them, they're more open to actually continue to read or listen to my voice message. Would you be willing to host a pop-up sip event at your house? I've got some new products that just released into the market and would love to let you and five of your friends try it and get some samples. It would only take about an hour. Would you be open to this? So I'm asking that open-end question, would they be open to this? If they say no, because you guys know that I, you're going to ask me, well, what if they say no? Um, say, I totally understand. Would you be willing to do an online event? And I can still get you some samples. So with that, newbies, you may be like, I don't know how to even do an online event. This is where you want to go back to the person that enrolled you, your sponsor, your team page, and say, hey, I need help, guys. Would anybody be willing to do an online event together and go because we can start doing those. So that's another great way to start creating excitement and to jump in on the pumpkin craze too and all the other new products. So that's something that, you know, I've been doing. Um, and it's really, again, going back to that basic of where do you start? Uh, don't worry if you don't know everything. You can actually read off the product sheet, print off some of the product and just highlight some of the products that you love, that you, maybe you joined because you're a customer, maybe you've got great results, but just make sure that you're confident in a couple. And if you have to, I've done this before guys, where teammates FaceTime me in and I actually do the party for them. So you can always do that. 
And even before we had like, honestly, before I had a smartphone because I didn't have a smartphone when I joined at works. How crazy is that? The flip awesome pink razor still have it. <laughs> and they would call me and put me on speakerphone. So there's always ways that we can be doing this and helping our team all across the country, all across the world. So, you know, it is limitless. So I want you guys to realize that it's what you want out of this. And so I'm going to fill you guys up with so many different things. So you've got that on, on, you've got that, your goal is those four customers. And then my adding distributors is the next goal, right? It's those four customers and three distributors, which, newbies you may not even know that's called the steps to success that should be our goal every single month and i even challenge myself and do it weekly so as you get going you know don't just settle set yourself up your personal goals of what you want and so that makes me go back to make sure that you're logging in and printing off your chart do you know what you want this month it's not too late to decide you know it's never too late to decide really what you want if it's three hundred dollars um, again, I was going through my notes and going back to that's helping three people that wants to earn money right now and helping them gather their two customers. And that's an extra $300 for you this month. And that's so doable right now. People are looking for that extra money to pay for, you know, those kids back to school. Mm -hmm. Christmas is coming, uh, making sure that you know that. So do you guys know what you want for this month? Do you have it written down? Do you have it written down? I want three distributors. I want four customers. Mm -hmm. I want two parties. Do you have these things written down so that you see them and have box to check off for them? Because if your goal is to just sign people up this month, that's a wide goal. Mm -hmm. But if you are very focused, you know how to put in the energy to get those. If you're just saying, I'm going to sign people up, I want to have a party. What's going to happen is you're just going to have a bunch of wasted energy because you're not going to do it as focused as you should. Yeah. And why do you want that $300? You got to dig in. So, so newbies, it's back to basics. Even for me, it's why do I want a thousand dollars? What does that do for, for my family? You know, is it, is that in my mind, it was always something that that was the number that I wanted to work towards every single month because it paid our bills. So maybe you're thinking, oh gosh, that thousand dollars could be used towards a vacation. You know, why do you guys want to, to sign three distributors? Maybe your heart is to help other people because this business has blessed you so much and you want to be able to let them see that they have the ability to stay home with their kids or to have freedom of time with each other, whatever that is, but you've got to have that why. So make sure that you're why is in there as well. Um, and reaching out authentically you, why did you join this business? And maybe I haven't asked you that as a, as a, as you joined, but that's something right now we can all go, why did we join this business? I know why I joined as I was sick of, uh, working 17, 18 hours a day, never seen my husband. We were going through bankruptcy. I was sick of standing in food lines. I wanted more and I didn't have a college education. How was I going to make money to get out of where we were at? And so this gave me that opportunity. I knew that network marketing created more millionaires really than, than athletes out there in any other industry. So why wouldn't I give this a shot? And so that's something that for me, that's really why I work so hard because I know that this um, industry, this profession doesn't judge who you are, or where you come from, and you can write your own paycheck starting today. And so why not go big, right? Um, and so that's really why I want you guys to, to do that is being you, brand new distributor, you just joined, maybe it's for weight loss because that was one thing too that I wanted is, are you in this to make a couple extra hundred dollars? What is that going to do for you? I'm excited this month. I just joined and I'm excited to get my first $300 because it's going to pay for the kids Christmas. Whatever that is, start thinking about that and sharing that. Um, I'm excited. I'm almost a diamond. New distributor, you're almost a diamond. I'm going to speak that over you. If you're a diamond, you've hit the diamond rank. You're almost a double diamond. You know, whatever rank you're at, always go beyond because I don't want you to settle and just sit where you're at. So make sure you're doing that. Um, okay, so we logged in, we looked at the product, 
you've got your chart printed out. So make sure you have your ruby emerald diamond. If you guys have already hit those ranks, you need to be printing those di or those ruby and emerald diamond charts out for your team. And why that is, is because when you start working and helping other people see their chart, you're gonna go up and it's gonna keep you focused and committed to your team. I know when I start slacking and not looking at my chart, things go haywire, I'm not as focused, I'm a little bit lax on things, I'm not pushing my team and keeping them accountable, right? So that's our job, that should be something, why should I back off of that new person that came in with me? They trusted me, so this fall I've really decided I need to get back to really being on them and what they want out of their goals. So after this Zoom, if you have team, go back through and follow up with them, print out their charts and go, are you in with me on this? If not, that's okay, you let me know when you are, okay? So we're gonna do that. Um, how do we get paid? I think this is something too that's so basic. And if we don't know how to get paid, won't we get frustrated? You know, that was something I look back and go, if somebody would just tell me what to do, I will do the work because I need to make money. Does anybody else feel that way? I want to make money. Stephanie, tell me what to do. Okay. So that was me. I was hungry for it. I was willing to be uncomfortable. I was willing to do parties when I didn't know anything about anything other than watching my back office, which that's more than, than better than not knowing anything. And so I was willing to do what they, what those top earners were doing. I thought if I just mimic them, eventually I'll get better and better. And so again, for me, I was like, if somebody could just show me how to make a thousand dollars. So with our comp plan, we get paid a few different ways. We get cash from selling our product. So parties, you're not only going to a party to help someone and get paid on those customers residually, but you can be making cash from those parties. Like that's always a good feeling. Uh, Weekly bonuses. This is where, for me, this is the number that stood out for me. This is where I really wanted it. When you enroll a new distributor, they're set up on an 80 BV plus auto ship. And you help them gather their two customers. That's $100. And those are paid weekly. And you can sign as many distributors as you want. There's no limit to that. And so that's where I was like, what? Okay, I can do the work. I can help people. I can help them host their party. Uh, whether they're in Michigan, California, France, I don't care where they're at. I can help them do an online party, walk them through how to do it, just get in front of people. So make sure you guys are doing that and being excited about that. Um, and then our residual income. And that's really where uh, I kind of got frustrated because at my residual check, our first check was not that big. I was actually like, oh, that's it. I can't live on $26, that. $26, that, what am I going to do with that? So as you grow and as you understand, it makes sense. We get paid on that, but the bigger your team gets, the more that you're helping your team and they're bringing in through their efforts, the more that your check's going to go up. And so I just didn't understand the comp plan. So make sure that you go in and you guys read a little bit about the comp plan. Uh, we get paid through our loyal customers our personally enrolled distributors, our team building weekly in cash. And so great ways to get paid. And, and for me, maybe I want $200 this week. You guys could do that still. It's Monday, help two people join your team, help them gather their first two to four loyal customers this week. And bam, next Friday, you get paid $100 for each one of those. So simple and basic that we forget. And I know if you guys are having these parties, you're asking people to host parties for you you're going to get distributors at the party. You're gonna convert those customers into distributors or you're gonna create another party from that party. Um, so I got those, let's see. Um, here's something too that I'm just gonna post up. It's a tip called zero to 10, okay? So this is how do we get these distributors? And um, I'm just gonna put that up there. You guys can, can do this because I'm gonna bring on a guest on, on parties because Right now where I'm seeing, yes, we do host to post. Yes, we do social. But for me, I've always felt the passion with parties. And, and I'm seeing that through our teams that are actually doing that right now. They're the ones that are on fire. They're creating that, that fire out in California right now. And I love it because they're texting me. They're engaged. 
they're building community and they're going to continue to do that. So parties create um, excitement, they create community, they keep, they keep retention within your team. And that's going to be something that's just so powerful to start doing. Did you post the zero to 10? Okay. So that's just something too on following up. How can we reach out to distributors um, that maybe we've talked to? So Eileen can't, can you unmute her? Can I'm she, unmute, for there's, oh, that's, uh, let's see if she can, Joel's looking to unmute you. Maybe, maybe she can unmute herself. We lost her. Can you hear me? Okay. There, there you, you are. are. I was like, where are you? Thought, thought we lost you for a second. See if we can, <laughs> I was like, where is she? So, there she is. All right. So Eileen got out of, I think, soccer. Were you at soccer a little early? Yes. I, yes. So I coach high school soccer and I coach club soccer. So right now I got done with um, high school training. And then once I'm done here, I'm going to go to soccer club. Awesome. So Eileen is a double diamond, you guys, with us. Um, her and I know there's, I think I saw Liz on too, but this team at El Arena, she just had a party Liz was at. But the girls out in California right now are really getting in front of people. And I'm loving their messages. And so um, I can't post the picture, but I'll post it up later. I'll put it in team pages or wherever you guys saw this so you can actually get it. But I love that she just has a simple, all it is, is it says step and shop, lose weight, detox, skin products, energy. So she created a kind of a, an invite. So I'm just going to show what she shared, what she's been doing with her invite. But Eileen, I want you to just kind of share what's working. What are you guys doing right now? Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. So what we started, so I told the girls, I think we need to go old school. So we started going old school. So we started doing launch parties, but sit parties. So um, a few girls, my San Bernardino girls, we started um, a few launch parties over there. And sorry. Sorry, did I lose you guys? No, nope, you're, you're there. there. I just can't okay, see. Sorry, oh, right, I had are. called coming in. Sorry. So we started launching parties, and what they did, they started in, inviting about roughly five to ten people. Um, one of my distributors, what she did is um, she invited everybody in her neighborhood, <laughs> and I loved it. And um, we had a few girls show up. We had our samples. We had our most popular samples there. Um, what I did, I had everything that I loved, which was everything, all the products. And I showed them and we sampled it. We made it right then and there. We showed them how easy it is to take our products, how easy it is to make our products, how easy it is to take it on the go. Um, and they loved that. What we started to do as well, um, I started having, um, I started driving. So like my, I'm in Bakersfield. So I'm about two to three hours away from majority of my team. So I still make the drive to my team or they'll make the drive over here. We'll have launch parties. And what we started noticing is when we get excited doing these parties, the, the guests get excited and they're seeing it. They're seeing the results. They're seeing the stories. They're hearing the stories and they're seeing the, the results. And what we're, what we're doing right now, we're doing a 30 day challenge with our team. And that way we're creating our own before and afters. So when we go to these parties, we're showing them our befores. So I always love to show my before because if you guys seen it, I was at 192 pounds and now I'm at 165 pounds. So people are like, oh my God, that's you? I'm like, yeah, that is me. And it, it's crazy because they think, okay, this is just a quick weight loss product. And, I, and, and then when we show oh, them, the results, they're, they're loving it. You don't look good at Um. Did I lose you guys? No, hold on. Joel was muted somebody. Okay, you should be good. Okay. And um, what we started doing as well is giving our testimonies. Testimonies is what people are loving. And um, I always love to give my testimony because people get so teary-eyed, I guess you could say, um, because uh, I was diagnosed with lupus seven years ago. So ever since I have been on It Works, um, it has helped a lot. And um, when I first was diagnosed, I was on 10 medications. And recently, probably two years ago, I'm now only on one medication. So like people are loving, they're like, what are you doing? What are you taking? Like, I want your energy. And it's, it's like, it's the product, guys. It's the product. And I tell them, I'm taking this and I'm taking that. And they're like, okay, I want that. And I want that. And when we're doing these parties, we're not enrolling the LCs just with one product. We're enrolling with at least three products. Mm -hmm. We got one Elsie last week, and she enrolled with the 
I'm all in package. So, and, and that's with samples that we have on site and they're loving it. It's, and it's fun going back to old school. It's fun to going back to these parties. It's fun to showing them what our, how amazing our products are. And we're enrolling distributors as well. We had um, one of my girls, Christy, I don't know if she's on. Um, her daughter goes to all of our, pro par our parties and she's not a distributor. And just last week she went to the, um, the tri event in Ontario and joined that night. That's and she's awesome. been going to our, all of our uh, launch parties and sample parties. And she's officially said, you know what? I want to be doing what you guys are doing. We're like, let's do it, girl. So that's a couple hints, guys. I remember bringing people that weren't distributors and just saying, hey, I need a friend to go with me. I'm not asking you to do anything, but can you just help me? How many people do you have on your friends list that aren't a distributor or customer yet, but would go and do a road trip with you? I think that's important for us to do because now all of a sudden they're helping you not even realizing and they're like, I can do this business or say for whatever reason, you don't get a distributor there, but you get these customers go back to your friend and go, you know what? You help me with this. I can help you again with the next party. Here's some customers. So, you know, really think about that. That's great. She's seen, you know, Eileen have fun having Christy having fun. It's a community of, of, we get paid to party guys like really like that how crazy so me and joel used to always do this together we still do it together as we go think go to places we'll go to dinner before after but it's only about an hour you know you guys can make it quick um eileen i'm gonna pull you back on because i want you to be specific you said products but i want to know what products are you sampling i want you guys to know what are some she said about three, three to five products she's probably bringing. So tell us what products are you bringing that people are loving? So um, what I'm bringing is BFF and I make it right then and there and I show mm. them how easy it is. Um, I bring my frother and they're like, what is that? <laughs> and, and so we're, um, we're, we sample off the BFF. We also do our super greens as well as the cleanse. Um, we do super greens, VFF, cleanse. We also do the celery. We've had a few people try the celery, and a, and a, lot, of, a lot of people liked it, and a lot of people didn't. Um, we did tell them, you know, it's the best thing on the market right now. Everybody's mm -hmm. doing it. You want to do it as well. Um, we are also doing um, the keto energy sticks. So I tell them, you know, as a, a lupus survivor, energy is one thing we lack. And that keto energy, it's like, amazing mm -hmm. and so I feel like I'm an energy bunny when I take it and so people are like oh you know I don't have energy as well you know I I it's, I struggle in the morning I'm like this is what you need mm -hmm. you need this keto energy I'm telling you it's all natural it tastes like uh, a lemon head and it's amazing yep and that's perfect I didn't even think about really having the BFF guys that's so easy just to mix up like she said in super cold water because it tastes like an almond joy. It's actually super good. So I, I love that. Um, I was thinking you were going to say keto coffee because I'm thinking right now with all the pumpkin spice stuff, but you know, whatever you're passionate about, whatever you love, people will want, will go towards that because that's the product that you truly love. You have something to say? Oh, I thought you were going to, you're going to go like <laughs> say something, but, um, I love that. And are you booking parties from the parties? I am. Um, and then what we're doing as well. So right now my team posted, we did, um, it's, it's, it says fall y'all. We're so excited. Who else is loving this season right now? What we're looking for is roughly five, maybe six. If we have enough room for somebody to have to do something super fun for us. And it's so easy, no purchase necessary. And in return, you may just get $100 in free products. And my team are getting like so many people like, we want, I'm in, like sign me up, what do we have to do? Mm -hmm. And so, and that's how we're getting people to host parties for us again. I love that. I mean, and that's back to basics, back to, like she said, old school. That is how we built the business. And so I think um, having that connection I know that it's making me jealous of all the Cali girls right now because I'm like, ah, keep me posted. And I see Ellerina on and she had an amazing party as well. Like the same, same mm -hmm. time. So 
she what? signed two lo- she sound- she signed two loyal customers last week at her lunch party. Yeah, so I mean you guys it's just all of a sudden people start Amazing. following what you're doing, <laughs> right? So mm-hmm. now you just got to start asking. And so go back to the to the beginning ask the people for favors. Like that's something that we need to do. Go back to your relatives. You know, maybe your mom can host a party. Do you go to church groups? Are, does your mom go to church groups? Does your aunt? Like, where can we go to start asking for just the online parties? Everybody knows that HAP stands for host to post, uh, but out in the real world, it stands for host a party. So just start doing more of those. Yeah. Yep. Uh, Eileen, was there anything else that, you know, stood out to you, what you're seeing, um, or any last minute thoughts or... Yeah, what we started doing as well is we started wrapping people. So like if you're having these launch parties or sample parties with the other distributors, have that camera ready. Go live, take pictures. Um, what we did we, when we had um, a launch party a couple of weeks ago, um, one of my distributors was wrapping her, uh, her cousin, actually, um, her legs. And we went live and we took some pictures and people were like, I didn't know you could use a wrap on your legs. Uh, yeah, you could wrap yourself from the neck down. So people were like, okay, yeah, I want that. And that's, if you're, if you're showing people what you're doing and they're seeing that other people are wanting to try it as well, they're going to be like, okay, I want to do it as well. She's doing it. I want to do it. And that's, and that's it, guys. It's really that simple on keeping it that basic. So, um, Eileen, thank you for popping on. I know that you were crazy busy. Uh, California, guys, West Coast. So I know that it's 5 o'clock when they jump on. So um, I appreciate her coming on and, and being out there and just setting California on fire. Not literally, but still, you know, like, <laughs> I, I, just, I just love that. And I love the excitement. And you know, having customers come in with more than one product. And so here's another tip that we used to talk about so much. Have you posted everything yet? No. Okay. Um, yeah, go ahead I'm and do that. Finishing up with this and one. so I'm going to have, you can, un, you can mute Eileen now if she, or yep, yeah, perfect. Oh, she did it herself. So what we can do is this. I want you guys to think about this. Say that you book two parties a week and um, you have your three to five people come to the party if you're getting those three customers, say three LCs with over over 100 in product, and we talked about that a little bit about going Ruby in a week, right? So last week that was the video that we did, but you do two parties a week and you have three loyal customers sign up uh, or whatever, two to five, that's about say 500 in BV. There's a thousand in BV from just hosting two parties a week. And so if you did two parties a week, in the month, there's an extra 4,000 in volume. Does anybody want that in their team? I mean, that's so close to going diamond. So we talked about going Ruby in a week. Now with just adding those parties, having those launch events with that new distributor that you're bringing on. If you have never done a launch party, that's something tonight to do, to ask people to help you do a launch party yourself and create that momentum for yourself and for your team. And now all of a sudden you're going to have that volume week after week from parties and people are going to get the results and they're going to want to join because they're seeing that. So now we just created 4,000 in volume by just having a couple of parties a week. And that's really, you know, an hour out of your time at night. So that's what I did. I actually used to do parties way more than that. Um, and I would drive or even go, five, six, seven, eight hours. So if you have team that's out of state and you want to combine some things and get a group team together, I would do multiple parties throughout the day. Um, One thing I don't want you to freak out about is everybody always says, well, I don't know if I want to have it in my house. You don't have to have them in your house. You can have them at a Starbucks. We used to actually do it Panera Bread quite a bit. So I would fly in to wherever they are. Or if I know like next week I'll be in Florida. If I can get somebody to host a sip and sample at a Panera before the event, you're going to see me doing that. I search the area. I go onto Instagram or I go through my friends list and I see who's in the area. And if they've never hosted an event, I want to try to do that before or even after, because I'm going to make the most money that I can while I'm traveling. So if you love to travel, if you know you're going somewhere, why not? Maybe your kids have a 
softball game, baseball game or whatever, why don't you have a little get together with the moms at the party? Hey, I'm going to do a quick sample of some of my products. You guys want to try this? I can whip us up some of the pumpkin spice coffee. Like you'd be surprised at how many places you can actually do, do these. So that's something to, again, to think about. So you guys should be loaded with really, yes. I, I'm just going to specifically say uh, pumpkin spice is definitely for cheer moms. So if anybody out there is doing cheer and dance, you know, I don't want to pigeonhole it, but I'm pretty sure they're all walking in with pumpkin spice lattes all the time. And I know I see people laughing because you know exactly what I'm talking about. Yep. So, so why is it important to be basic? I think that's the, the one thing that we want to do is get back to being basic and don't forget the simplicity of this business of really, whether you feel stuck, you're new, where do you start? You start by asking for favors. And I love that. I pulled that old, old message out, um, of doing that. And you have to set the time. You have to be coachable. You have to be hungry. I don't know what Joel's doing. Uh, you have to be willing to learn and have that work ethic that you want to create that income and that life that you want. And, and so logging in tonight, maybe you've never have, making sure that you understand the product, starting the, that list of who you're going to reach out to, having those parties, and then creating the simplicity of that through your team. And that's really the basics of what we do is mm -hmm. we get paid by helping people order product as a customer and then joining our business as a distributor. There's really no, nothing else that, you know, we really need to ever go over. I think um, we see and compare and go, well, they did this or they did that, but you just got to get into your own grind and go back to, I need to set some parties, whether that be online, in person, and still doing social to create those customers and distributors as well. But you guys are going to rock it out. I know. Um, Hopefully they can comment on here and you guys got some really good tips on truly keeping it as basic as you can and going through that. Joel, was there anything else that you had or was? No, I think that's all the notes that you got. I, I sure hope so. So thank you, Eileen, for um, posting the it's fall y'all. We're back in the grind. We're back in routine. We're back to being basic. It's okay to be basic and not forget that. It's super simple if we're just willing to get out there and do it. So uh, let's get you that Ruby in a week. If you didn't watch that one, go back and watch that one. And then, you know, this is such a great one of creating those parties to get you that volume. Um, if you're wanting that volume to go diamond and beyond, and we know that you all want that. So uh, thanks guys for always coming in on Monday nights. Actually next week, we're going to be doing it on Tuesday. And the reason why I'll be at, uh, Mark's ranch. So this should be on your dream board of what you want, want to do, but we're going to be out at the loyalty and legacy, um, event on Monday night. So we won't be able to do Monday night, but stay tuned next Tuesday because green carpet. Oh no, wait, is it this Tuesday or two? Never mind. Just kidding. Monday night's regular night. It's the following. I'm just preferring you for a couple of weeks. I think I'm excited for green carpet or something. Uh. Uh, so ignore me. Uh, I will see you next Monday, the following week. You can put it on your calendar for that Tuesday. And uh, we'll have you loaded with a lot of special things after green carpet. Uh, lots of stuff that's going to happen that's going to blow you away. So get out and sign those distributors and you'll be glad that you did in those customers before green carpet. So that's a little like added fuel for you guys to get out there and really uh, be excited for what we have coming. So I appreciate y'all and have an awesome, awesome week. We'll see you next week.